Here we have a 70 plate BMW 330e M Sport Pro Edition. Now this vehicle comes with the 19 inch gloss black alloy wheels, all of which are in excellent condition and unmarked with the blue M Sport brake calipers behind. We do have the Dravit grey metallic paintwork, LED headlights, we also have the gloss black front grills and front splitter. There's a look at that front end. Now we also have the M Performance Kit on this vehicle, so as you come around to the passenger side you can see we have the side skirt on the bottom. We have the second alloy wheel, let's take a closer look, you can see it again unmarked. We also have colour coded door handles, black door mirrors, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. Up top you find the black roof rails, shark for antennae and also the rear spoiler. Now we do have front and rear parking sensors with a visual display and a rear reversing camera as well. We have the dual exit exhaust with the rear diffuser at the back along with a power operated tailgate. If we press the button on the remote you find the boot will open just like so. Inside of here you can see we have plenty of space for whatever you may need and there's a closer look. You can see we have the parcel shelf at the top along with the netting. We also have hooks on the left hand side of it, 12 volt connectivity. Coming back out we also have a button up here, press this button and then the boot will close again like so. The tailgate is also split so if you just press the button underneath here we can open up the glass part of the tailgate and get easy access inside of there. Close that back and then coming back around to the driver's side you can see the vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. So if we take a look then at the interior now, coming into the back first, you'll find the full black leather seats, foldable armrests in the centre and fixed ISO points as well back here. We do also have the M Sport style seat belts, then have the vents with the climb control in the centre for the rear passengers, electric windows on the doors. Taking a look at the front now, you'll find the same leather seats, both the front seats are being heated, there is a quick look at both of them. Moving across to the doors you find the electric mirrors and electric windows, charlock for the rear, automatic lights down here, the ambient lighting, we also have the automatic wipers, multifunctional steering wheel which is also heated. Taking a seat inside you find the digital dashboard in front of us, put a foot on the brake, press the start button, the vehicle will start up for us, heat steering wheel button is in the centre, we also have the cruise control and speedometer on the left, paddle shifters either side of the steering wheel, with the high beam assist on that stalk there. You can see we are free from any warning lights on the digital dashboard. We also have the main infotainment screen in the centre, which is currently shown the sat nav. If any of these screens or lights are flickering, it's just the camera, they're not flickering in real life, so nothing to worry about. Moving across and further down, you find we have the buttons. So if we click onto media, the radio stations, we also have the other media options here on the left. Bluetooth phone connectivity as well for phone calls. And then we have a range of apps here that are currently installed, along with having the Android Auto and Apple CarPlay on the left. Then back onto the main menu, we can go up to car, onto the settings, you'll find the interior ambient lighting, plenty of colours to choose from on here. Intelligent safety system, making it a very safe vehicle to drive. And for moving further down, you'll also find the dual zone climb control for the front passengers, ice cold air conditioning with the heated seats as well on either side. Further down, you find some storage underneath here with the cup holders, 12 volt connectivity, USB, and also we have the wireless phone charging. That can be simply closed like so. Automatic gearbox with the different drive modes. Press onto these buttons and you can quickly switch through all the different drive modes just like so. Also, change the look of the dashboard for some drive modes as you can see just there. Put the car into reverse, you find the reversing camera with the parking sensors on the right. Put it back into your park by pressing P. You then have the electric handbrake, auto hold button and the armrest here in the centre. That's all I'm going to show you guys today. If you'd like to find out more, please check out the website. This vehicle comes with a fresh service, fresh MOT and free nationwide delivery. Thank you for watching. Video test drive of this BMW 330e M Sport Pro Edition. Now the purpose of this video test drive is to show the vehicle it drives as to be expected to. As you can see, I'm now to fire my steering wheel to keep it in a straight line, not being off to left, or to right hand side staying straight and through. Now we're doing the multifunction steering wheel which has the power shifters on either side. If you want to set the car into manual mode, simply tap on the paddles to change gear. 
we are set the cruise control and steering buttons here on the left hand side, along with the five buttons on the right. Digital dashboard in front of us, we can share with different bits of information. Now, if you do listen carefully throughout the video test drive, you'll also notice we'll be free from any unwanted knocks or bangs. We also have the full level seats around the vehicle, really comfortable, and you can easily do it too, free. With 400 miles in this vehicle, still get out feeling fresh. Both front seats are also heated, which is perfect for them in cold winter mornings. Now, we also have many more features on the interior of this vehicle. We've got the main infotainment screen in the centre, which is currently shown the sat nav, but also has plenty more features we've seen photos. Below there we have the dual zone climate control with the Asgard air conditioning, perfect for the hot summer days. We have the automatic gearbox which is really smooth through all the gears, along with having all the different drive modes as well. Now we also have the intelligent safe system which makes it a very safe vehicle to drive. We have the ambient lighting running all throughout the vehicle which looks really nice at night time. Now we've got our right indicator on, we're starting to slow down. We're going to wait for this traffic to pass before we can make the right hand turn onto the industrial park, wait for this car to go, and then turning right, and it will perform an emergency stop now in 3, 2, and 1, hard up to the brakes, put the car into reverse, got the reverse camera, back into drive with no issues whatsoever. Now if this video has answered all your questions, then please feel free to get in contact with our sales team, where you can answer all and answer questions, along with waiting for some inquiries of you. That's all for me today though. Cheers.